this is a Pashan and you wouldn't think from the look of these buildings that there is any wildlife around here but don't get fooled because just after this building there is a small hill type of thing over there and if you see over there over there you sometimes get peacocks But still, it's not a proper forest area thing. So, because we are in Pune, we are quite close to the Western Ghats, and that's where we'll be going. Lonaura, to be precise. So we are over here in Lonawara in the resort and it looks pretty good I mean perfect snake area and we will scare the snakes at night let's see if we see one These are tailor birds. Carla being in the western ghats has many toads and they are quite big. Hello guys, today we are going to go to Karla Caves and it's uh, it is a beautiful place and well, right beside it there is the temple of Mata Equira and it's a famous temple and Karla Caves is also famous and so what's more, let's get started going up to the caves at the temple is actually a trek i mean they have given stairs for you but it's like a trek and so here are the things we are we saw so we made it to the top <laughs> So I won't be giving any temple photos because I do not know if it's oh, anyways just let's see the caves because it's Karla caves but the temple is also good I mean it's very famous and all that but it's good yeah so let's go on to the caves so this is the first cave and it's very old you can just look at the elephant tail. and yeah there are two caves i'll be showing both of them and yeah i won't be able to take uh, videos because it's not allowed so i hope you like the photos and yeah and uh, this photo looks quite eerie but really it's not eerie that like that it's just because i 
it's just because i had it at a faster shutter speed so it's come dark and those statues are coming from both sides and they meet at the dome this is the roof of the cave these are said the inscriptions that is are said to be the names of the people who donated well for so that the people could build this cave and it looks quite not it doesn't look quite remarkable but at a closer look like look at these statues they have been carved out of rock okay so we are now in the second cave and it's got two floors so here we are on the top floor yeah i mean there we have got stairs and then there's a second floor up here and there's a window out here so you can see who all is there and all the view and all that and another carving on the ground on the ground floor and this is the emblem of india and it's also the emblem of ashoka and it's basically three lions on a pillar but the front lion is quite i mean they're so old that mud has formed on them and on the mud grass has started growing and by some coincidence the grass is growing on the lion on the front lion's nose well that's it friends and yeah don't forget to subscribe to see other videos i did in lonawara or karla however you call it both are almost the same so dear and don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you can see a snake over here right well it looks very beautiful maybe but i feel it's beautiful but look, just look at how the pattern on its back it's striped with dots and it's on its tail it's striped it's a slender tail wow but you may not feel the same way anyways let's just get started so this snake is a striped keel back and in marathi it's called a nani ti and in hindi it's called a dharidhar dhuriya and a patavalo saap or a kankha kankha hiu in gujarati helai in bengali kauchiya in oriya nikiton kutti in tamil and many more names for it just yeah so its average length is 1 feet 1 foot 4 inches and its maximum length is 2 feet 7 inches and it is found in india all over india except kashmir and andaman nicobar islands and it is found in damp places like yeah damp places and grasslands and paddy fields and it eats frogs toads lizards etc and when they are small that is juvenile they feed on tadpoles and they are diurnal and so if you look at this photo you can see that it's uh, it's not very it's very blurry i know because it's digitally zoomed but if you look at the photo you can see that beneath the eyes it has 
a black stripe two black stripes in fact see that and over here we can see that its top part the body the uh, half of its body the top part of its body is banded type of and the lower half of its body is striped with yellow in black there are yellow stripes and when i saw this snake i first confused it with the mountain trinket snake but the main difference between them is that the trin mountain trinket snake is black striped in yellow not yellow striped in black the tail that is so yeah and the mountain is a bit big bit thicker and the nani tea that is striped keel back is very uh shy it doesn't like to be with for that sense not all every snake doesn't like people so yeah but it's this one is all snakes prefer to run away from humans and an inf interesting fact is that every snake can swim i mean some snakes swim better than others but all of them can swim yeah i bet you didn't know that and look at this photo it's in action running away from me so now we'll see a video of the snake in action and over here yeah it's going really fast with the, this part is i was rather shaky with the camera so yeah so it's trying to find a route to escape from me i mean i'm not going too close to it because it can bite it's not it's a non venomous snake but still every snake can bite yeah so yeah it's got a really long tail was and it's heading wow that action is wow well the nane the nane ti in marathi striped keel back in english is a very small snake and very thin uh, but if you want to see other snakes subscribe to this channel i had done it i had finally got the shot i wanted the shot of a snake and here we are back in pashan and i just wanted to share a fact with you guys so when we did the booking in the resort we saw the in the email that the booking was for 5th september we were like hey we booked for 9th september then we saw the year the year was 2021 this is 2022 so that means that we went over there exactly one year where we saw the fipsin shield tail where i made the snake not so much a snake video so which is the first video of mon so basically this is one year one year at the exact same where it started and it ends at the same spot one year for mon